Hello, so this is 149 Brockway, five bedrooms, three and a half baths, um, right about 2884 square feet. So when you, this is, as soon as you come in the front door, this is what you see here. The floors are not done, but this will be LVP. And this will be your formal dining room with the comfort ceilings, the archway there. And then you open these two doors here. This will be a, a closet. Okay. It has the columns. Again, this is where it will be LVP here. This will be your powder room or guest bath. Again, there's no electrical in here yet, but this is where it would be. This is your garage. It's just one step down, two car garage. Okay. And then you step inside here is a laundry room and has the cabinetry up in here. It's a dark gray. And then it has the um, countertops here. So you have storage as well as your wash and dryer area, laundry room. Right under the stairway, you have more storage. Okay. You come into your living space here with the fireplace, ceilings, the high ceilings, the uh, crown molding in here. Of course, your island with the area for chairs, seating around it. All right, this would be your pantry. Your stove would be here. And this is the countertops. And then the cabinetry is this darker gray color. Stove would be there. Space for your refrigerator, refrigerator, dishwasher, it's your sink, and then another eating area here. Okay. It's your doors to access the backyard. It is covered and it'll have electrical there. It's normally a light. This is the space between the homes in the backyard and you can see from the neighbor's fence it goes a good ways back um, so back probably so i don't know if you can see it but there's a little pink um, tie on the tree so based on your neighbor's fence it goes back a good ways there okay. no sod yet down down yet so there's the homes there this is the back of this house Okay, this is 149 Brockway. Uh, it's five bedrooms, three and a half baths, um, 2884 square footage. And this one will be ready mid July. Archway going into your owner's suite here. The tree ceilings. Here's your owner suite bath, double vanity, bar and tub, standing showers there. This would be your water closet, your commode. And then this is the walk-in closet here. So it goes all the way around. And my apologies for the lighting. They don't have it in the electrical. Well, they have it installed, but no lights yet. So let's take a look upstairs at the other four bedrooms upstairs, and then you have another two full bathrooms upstairs as well. They do have the wrought iron spindles. Okay, so we come up to the top of the stairs. We'll go to the left first. This is the first bedroom here. This is actually a bonus space, not a bedroom. So it could be a TV room, hangout space, office. And then here to the right is the bedroom. Has the closet with the double doors. Okay. All right, 
Let's head on down the hallway. Another bedroom here. Same closet as the other room. Okay. More storage. Okay. Okay. This one has a different closet, but also has a window in the closet. Okay. This one also has access to the bathroom. So it will be a shower tub combination with a double vanity. And then we're back out into the hallway. And then here's another room here. And then there's another bathroom here that connects with another bathroom here. So this room is a suite, it has its own bath, double vanity. It has a, a garden tub, as well as a standing shower. Does not have a water closet, the commode will just be here, but then it has an, a walk-in closet as well. So you have the options for two suites. And this room is towards the side of the house. That's your neighbors there. So again, you can see the neighborhood and the proximity to the neighbors. Okay, this is 149 Brockway, five bedrooms, three and a half baths, 2984 square feet. So I'll start from the top of the stairs again. To your left is a bonus space. Could definitely be a bedroom, but it's not counted in your bedroom, so it does not have a closet. And then you so you have your owner suite on the first floor. This is a second bedroom, the third. Here's your fourth bedroom that also has a large closet and access to the bathroom here. And then this is the fifth one, which is also a suite with its own attached bath, double vanity, and it has then the sunken tub and the stand-up shower. And the shower is tiled all the way up. Okay, so I'll take a look at the front of the house. I'll go back out and let you see the front of the house. And then I'll also film 150. I was not able to film 128. Um, I think it is the same, similar floor plan. I have to check and see. But um, it was locked up because that one's almost done. It'll be ready in June. This one will be, will be ready in July. Okay. Okay. All right, let me step outside. Again, no grass. Just this great Carolina sand that gets stuck everywhere. So this is the neighborhood. If you go to the end of this street, there's a roundabout where the pool and cabana and everything is located. Now this neighborhood does have brand new apartments in the front when you first come in, like when you turn off of the main road, but then you come into the neighborhood where the homes are located. And these are single family homes. They have another subdivision in this area, very close, that is, um, like ranch style homes definitely smaller square footage but um those are also here and then they do have some town homes that are rentals um as well in this area and this is right off of clemson road um, which 20 runs less than five minutes from here and then 10 minutes the other way down clemson road it turns into killian and you would be on 77 going towards um charlotte so that was 149 brockway